It's hard to tell from the outside, but tucked away behind the walls of this business park is a 38,000 square foot facility that is home to the largest online retailer of bowling ball equipment in the world. Keith Spear is the president and CEO of BowlingBall.com. He's always loved bowling. In 1977, while in college, he was the Brunswick National Amateur Champion and toured Europe for a couple of weeks. He started his business in 1981 when he opened his first pro shop in Fort Lauderdale. I had a couple pro shops, moved up into this area, opened a pro shop up in Deltona in 81, opened Sunshine Lanes in 84, I think. At one time we were up to 15 pro shops, but then the economy went bad in 07, 08. Keith actually started selling online well before the early 2000s. During his college years in the ROTC, he had exposure to the internet, but he didn't know where it would go. We were selling on eBay before they were public. Mm. It was still a privately little held company that was doing half a million dollars in revenue. We were testing those waters. He kept a close eye on the internet and bought some domain names, including bowlingball.com. I loved the internet. And what I thought was great about the internet is that the information should be free. Content should be free. That's, where, that's why you went to the internet back then. There really wasn't, you didn't go buy anything. Mm -hmm. So we started building a lot of content on our site. And my thought was, well, if this thing ever does evolve into commerce, if we have the content, we'll get around this content, we'll build a community. And then when the commerce comes, we'll fulfill the third C. So we went content, community, then commerce. Keith says by the time people were no longer afraid to put their credit card numbers in a browser and operating system, his online company was pretty well set up. We had a pretty good foothold. Uh, we had tens of thousands of free articles on our website. We had people used to coming to our website. 120,000 members there. If you wanted to know how this was done or why this were, was done, why is the lane 60 feet, all that information was on our site. Bowlingball.com sells bowling balls, bags, shoes, and other accessories direct to the end consumer. They sell major brands such as Storm, Brunswick, and Hammer, and they manufacture their own brand, Pyramid. In the beginning, they stored bowling balls at the pro shop. Then business started to pick up, and they got a storage unit and then another, and at one point, they had 25 storage units to store the bowling balls. In 2002, they moved into their current location in Daytona Beach. It just seemed to take off fast. Uh, it just, next thing you know, I went from doing customer service and working in the warehouse to hiring a customer service person. It just kept expanding, expanding, expanding. And I think we have 33 people now and we've expanded almost every single year. In addition to shoes and bags and all sorts of other bowling supplies, this warehouse holds more than 100,000 bowling balls worth more than $3 million in inventory. One of the longtime employees is Tony Rucco, the chief operating officer. I'm on year 26. I was 12 years old and uh, my grandma brought me into the bowling center, the old Daytona Bowl, and I was looking for lessons to start bowling. Keith had the pro shop and so he started giving me lessons and I was hooked. I couldn't work, obviously I was 12, but he gave me free bowling balls for, I would come in and take garbage out or go get him coffee. And uh, then in high school, I had to kind of start making decisions on what to do. And so he gave me an opportunity to sort of exchange I guess work for dollars there and so I stayed on, I didn't go to college, stayed on and worked for him and the rest is history I guess. <laughs> Tony manages all of the day-to-day -day operations, everything from ordering office supplies to designing and ordering bowling balls, bags and shoes. He also manages all overseas business including the manufacturing in China of their pyramid bowling balls and accessories. The company also has what they call the white glove treatment. If you buy a bowling ball from them, they will drill it and follow up with customers on the phone to make sure they're happy with their purchase. 
So this is my bowling ball that I've had for probably 20 years or so. And what can you do to help me uh, make this work better for me? We would recommend you have the ball resurfaced. As far as the fit, I'm going to start by having you put your thumb in the bowling ball. It's very easy to see where the holes should be based on where your joints are. So this is an adequate fit, but it's not a great fit. So I would start by extending this ring finger. I'd also plug these two holes because you, having smaller fingers, I would put lady ovals in here. This kind of customer service and expertise in the sport is why BowlingBall.com has 22,000 YouTube followers and about 20 million views on their videos. Because no one else really cares as much as we do. So it, it sounds kind of cheesy to say when it's bowling, but everyone's passionate about something and pretty much everyone in here is. Even the people that don't bowl have become very mm -hmm. passionate and they're proud of what they do. So that's a big difference. They, they care about taking care of the customers. So I think that makes us the best. For the Business Beat, I'm Joanne Magley.